Hello everyone, welcome to Eurovisionology, the study of Eurovision. You with Wen here, and this is Drama LVA20, the live show reaction for Latvia for Eurovision 2020. So all the nice finalists has already performed. Um, this is a very tricky one and uh, maybe like the most difficult choices from me, I have three possible winners today, and it really depends if I want to shoot by heart, by head, or by instinct. Uh, firstly, the one that I want to mention that it was actually in my top three before, and after this final, I just don't see it in my top three anymore. Um, uh, it just fell down to my fourth actually, and that's it. Katrina Dimanta with the song Heartbeats. Um, this one somehow I actually like their energy and I like how the song was in the pre-selection more, just because I feel like I liked how it was stripped back and very relaxing. Very, you know, it just looks like. That was very honest performance, and I could feel all the energy and everything. Um, I like the choreography in this final show more, but somehow I think it's lost the energy that I feel from the song or from uh, Katrina herself. I just feel like today when I rank everything on the live performances in the final, I feel like this is just only ended at my fourth instead of um, I put her at my second place before in the pre-selection round anyways it just only fell down to the fourth so the top three songs firstly if I have to pick this by heart I would definitely go with Edgar's Krelitz with the song Try the Might because I really really love him and I really love his song at the first time I listened to the song I thought that it's not as good as the one that he had from previous years but somehow it really grows on me and in the live performance this is one of a few ones that I feel like is a lot improved from the pre-selection round and I know that it could be even better. I love staging, I love the backup vocalist and I think Edgar's uh, vocals are actually a lot better than the pre-selection round so I just loved everything about it. Like I love him already from the beginning, uh, from previous years. So if I have to pick by heart, I will go with Edgar's. However, if I have to pick by head, I still think Samantha would be the best choice with the song Still Breathing. And it is actually the one that I like the most from the pre-selection round. Uh, from the pre-selection round, I selected Edgar's on the third, Katrina Dimanta and Heartbeats on the second, and Samantha Tina with Still Breathing on my first. Anyways, for now, I think if I still have to pick by head, I think the best one to be chosen to represent Latvia this year would still be Samantha with the song uh, Still Breathing. Just because I think this song has uh, such a big potential to be big on the stage. Somehow today though, I think that the staging is not as good as I expected. Just that sometimes it just went so dark and can't even see her facial expression or her dance move, you know, that's like one of the things that I like from the pre-selection round and I think I missed out on that part today. Also, they have changed the backup vocalist harmony, which I think I feel like something is missing. Maybe just because I really get used to the old version. Um, I think it's not bad, but for me, I actually already like how the backup vocalist was in the uh, pre-selection round and now I feel like something is missing because the harmony is actually gone. I mean, I like how they actually sang uh, with many tones uh, in the pre-selection round. Anyways, I think the problems that this one have the most today with being the live performance is actually 
uh, the camera work and the lighting. I really think this should be changed. Anyways, I, I, I really feel like this would be the best choice to be picked if I have to pick by hate because I think it has best potential uh, to be big on the big stage in Rotterdam. So, the last one and uh, the one that really surprised me the most today is uh, the one that I feel like if I have to go with my instinct, this is the best choice to be picked. And it is Anna with the song Polyester. Actually, I really, really enjoyed that. Um, this song was actually on my fourth, either like fourth or fifth. I, but anyhow, I, I like it from the pre-selection round. Anyway, today she has stepped up her game a lot. And I really feel like this is actually another good potential song that could be very, very big on the stage. It's like the song itself is very catchy, it's modern, it's fresh, and it just sounds like very captivating and her performance today is just very very good um, just you know just only like her by herself singing on the stage with like dancing and enjoying her things but that was already like captivating and drawing attention very instantly and the thing that I like the most in Anna's performance today is that her vocal is so on point it really sounds like the studio version like I don't even know if that's even possible but she sounds exactly like the studio version it's like she already have that studio vocals a studio voice with her and it I don't know it, it just somehow very interesting and captivating for me if I have to pick with my instinct I would say I will pick Anna with polyester. So tonight I only have three winners and I hope one of these three will be winning. Anyhow, after I know that one person is gonna win, I will feel very very bad with the other two. Okay, you know, just to really sum it up, I will rank it into top three. The third place, I will go by heart and pick Edgar's Krillis very sad but I would say um, he has less potential than the other two songs secondly if I have to go I will go with my instinct and pick Anna with polyester and the reason that I pick this one on the second and now go with my head and saying that Samantha is the best choice on the first I just feel like when having much potential like Samantha with still breathing, I just don't want to throw it away. And polyester is still very indie, so I'm not quite sure how it's gonna be doing. You know, with a very big variety, big ranges of uh, audience. Like this could fall to be like too indie, too many viewers as well. So I would just only put her on the second and of course my winner that I would still pick will still be Samantha Tina with the song still breathing with the new camera angles and the new lighting well we'll see soon how this will be and good luck to my top three good luck to everyone all right so I think this is the moment of truth I'm not sure how are they gonna announce this actually I didn't really understand most of the words of course uh, but however I hope that I will understand enough to get into the result um, and to really understand what is going on so good luck to my top three good luck to everyone and good luck to Latvia I hope you pick the best song let's see how it goes I really think they are like gonna announce the result here but I'm not sure like how would this work Triksna. what's that is that like wait 
Are they gonna have like a like a top three? I will break your heart. But I think the song that they're calling out now is maybe the one that's not going to. Like, do they have like a top three performance again later? Oh, <gasps> uh, maybe the Annals like from the ninth place. Wait, so nine, seven, nine, eight, seven, six. So I think this is top five now. I think. Mmm. He's doing good. They're doing well. They're doing well. So four more to go. Mixed doors. I'm falling for you. Good job. I adore this song. So, top three now. Wow. So Anna on the third. That's what I understand. So now the winner. I, I I believe they're gonna announce the winner. I don't think that they're gonna announce like a second place, right? That would be unusual. So I think they're just gonna announce the winner. And I hope to hear, of course, now between Katrina Dimanta and Samantha Tina. I would pick Samantha, please. Wait. Yes! <sighs> okay. Oh, so they were announcing the second place. I didn't understand that, but okay. Like, I was just waiting for someone to be happy about it, and it's Samantha. Oh, uh, finally. Finally, this girl is representing Latvia. After many years of trying, this is her year. And I think this is the best pick. So congratulations, Samantha Tina, and congratulations, Latvia. I believe that this is going to be a good result for you. I still believe that when I pick from my head after I listen to all the song, I, I really think that this is the best option. So congratulations. I really hope that Latvia will get one of their best results this year. Well, I believe that's all for the drama LVA20, the live show reaction of uh, Latvia for Eurovision 2020. I'm happy for Anna to get the third place um, because I really think that this song has very, very good potential. Even I didn't put her on the top three on the pre-selection, but I think she had improved herself a lot and I think she did a very, very good job today and ended up on the third place for her. I believe that she should be proud of herself already. Also, congratulations to Katrina Dimanta because I know I know that this song was on my second plate and today I have put it on my fourth but anyway still a good song good performance and so I just want to say congratulations for that as well uh, before I talk about the winner this is just a special note to my beloved Edgar Skrillis I still hope that he will come back next year with a bigger better stronger song and I hope that it will eventually be your year. You know, Samantha Tina has been trying for many years as well. Same with Edgars and also Marcus Riva, everyone knows that. So I really hope that Edgars will come back. I still wish that one of these incoming years, possibly next year, I mean, the best would be next year because I really can't wait to see Edgars to represent Latvia. Anyways, just want to say don't give up Edgars, I will always support you. I really wish you the best of luck in the future in anything in your career, in anything that you will do. I hope that it will be successful. Now, 
with the winner, Samantha Tina with the song Still Breathing. I really want to say congratulations again. And eventually, after many years of trying, she gets to represent Latvia. I believe that that is one of the biggest dreams that she had. And now she is successful on that. So, congratulations, Samantha. I hope that you will do very, very well in uh, Rotterdam this year. And I really want to see if there's going to be an improvement on the camera work and the lighting. Because I still think that this can be even better than this. So congratulations Latvia, congratulations Samantha Tina and the song Still Breathing. So I guess that's it for now. What do you think about the winning song of Supernova 2020 this year? Do you like it or you don't like it? What do you feel like when you see the performance on the stage? And also any other songs that you were rooting for? Any comments on any other? The performances just let me know in the comment section below after this there are still gonna be a lot more videos to come if you don't want to miss any of this don't forget to click subscribe below and I just want to say thank you very much for checking your originality I hope everyone enjoy my video and if you like it or if you don't like it anyhow just leave me the comment below and especially if you don't like it just let me know how would I improve on my next videos so I can do better Anyways, thanks for checking your visionology and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye for now!